Hey yo guys, it's your boy Kevin does it all back with another video guys and today guys today it is time for WrestleMania Backlash 2021 predictions guys. So yes guys finally we are having another pay-per-view. I feel like it's been a long time since we had another pay-per-view. So yes guys I can't wait for tomorrow WrestleMania Backlash 2021 and today guys of course is the predictions and then tomorrow the live reactions guys so yes guys, I can't wait for tomorrow and yes guys, uh, there's going to be 6 matches and comment down below how many times I said yes guys. So yes guys, <laughs> oh my gosh, I I'm not even trying to say it on purpose. Anyways, guys, uh, hopefully you enjoyed the video, smash the like and subscribe, guys and girls I mean. And smash the like and subscribe and yeah guys, this video is already off to a weird start. Anyways guys, it's probably going to get more weird on this point all the way to the end of the video, so stick around for the predictions, of course. So yes, guys, the first match I'm going to talk about is Roman Reigns, the Tribal Chief, the head of the table versus Zaro. I can't wait for this match. This is probably going to be the main event or the first uh, match, but probably it's going to be the, the main event. But Roman Reigns versus Zaro. Maybe Edge will return, but I'm thinking Roman Reigns, of course, has to win, but I really want Cesaro. Like, Cesaro is one of my favorite people, uh, one of my favorite superstars, I mean. And, like, if there was, like, some, like, superstars I really would want to, like, get a push, he's one of them. I'm so, I'm so glad he got a push. He would be one of the superstars I would choose to get a push, and I'm so glad he got a push. He beat the runs twice already. So, yes, guys. So, I can't wait for the match. Hopefully, Cesaro wins, but... Deep down, like, probably Roman Reigns is going to win. We all know deep down that Roman Reigns is probably going to win and retain. That's why I'm going with Roman Reigns, but I really want Cesaro to win. I won't be mad at all if Ro if Roman Reigns loses the title and Cesaro re uh, accomplishes his goal on winning the Universal title. I made that complicated. Anyways, guys, yeah, I really hope Cesaro wins, but I'm going to have to go with Roman Reigns to retain the title. I'm so sorry. So sorry, Cesaro. I love you. I really hope you win, but I'm going with Roman Reigns. Roman Reigns. Because Jimmy Uso might turn heel, or Jimmy Uso might uh, help Cesaro, but I'm still sticking with Roman Reigns. So yes, Roman Reigns to retain. Next match is Bayley versus Bianca Belair for the SmackDown Women's Championship. This is an easy one. Bayley is going to freaking lose to Bianca Belair, the EST of WWE. Bayley should just stick to being funny, because she's funny. Now nah, I'm playing. She's, she's really entertaining. She's really a uh, good wrestler, but... Maybe she like should make a tag team with someone else and go for the women's tag team titles because I don't think she's gonna be like the SmackDown Women's Champion again to a long time and of course Bianca Belair is gonna hold that title for a long time until maybe Becky Lynch returns. So yeah, guys, until someone good returns like Ronda Rousey or Becky Lynch or maybe AJ Lee. So yes, guys. So I'm a, I don't see Bianca Belair using the title until like a long time. So I'm going with Bianca Belair to retain. Next match is. The Mysterios versus Dolph Ziggler and Robert Roode. I can't wait for Rey Mysterio and Dominic to Mysterio to hopefully win and become the first father and son tag team champions. Hopefully, this is two people I love in the ring. And I just hopefully they win. Hopefully they win. Of course, Rey Mysterio, my childhood hero. And Dominic Mysterio, the son of my childhood hero. Or oh, one of my ch childhood heroes. Of course, John Cena, uh, Rey Mysterio. Uh, Undertaker, of course. Like, who can't have, like, Undertaker in their top 10, you know? Or Rey Mysterio John Cena. If you don't, smash the like and subscribe. If you do, smash the like and subscribe. Anyways, guys, I'm going with Dom Dominic Mysterio and Rey Mysterio, the Mysterios, to become the first father and son. So, yes, hopefully they win. Like, these are two people I love, and like I said already, and I really hope they win. Like, Cesaro, I really hope he wins, but he might not, but these are two people that could definitely win this match because Robert Roode and Dolph Ziggler kind of suck and Roman Reigns doesn't so you see the you see the you see the difference so that's why I didn't go for Cesaro but I'm going with the Mysterios for this one but like, of course Cesaro can win but I had to choose Roman Reigns but I'm going with the Mysterios to hopefully win alright next match is the match I'm looking forward to forward the most <sighs> Drew McIntyre versus Bobby Lashley versus Braun Strowman for the WWE Championship in a triple threat match it's going to be a crazy match. I can't wait for it. This is probably going to be the first match or the last match. But I think it's going to be a like a good match to start off WrestleMania Backlash. So it's probably going to be the first match. But who knows? We'll find out tomorrow. So anyways, guys, I'm going with... with What did I just say there? With... Like, I, I really want like to go with Drew McIntyre. 
but like us, like anyone could win. Like Drew McIntyre could do Claymore kick to Braun Strowman, and Bobby Lashley could just throw Drew McIntyre out and pin Braun, Braun Strowman, and he retains. Or like Drew McIntyre could do the same Braun Strowman, and it's anybody's game at this match. But I have to like I really want Drew McIntyre to win. I really want Braun Strowman to win, and I'm loving Bobby Lashley as a champion, and I really want him to face Brock Lesnar at SummerSlam. But like maybe Braun Braun Strowman has a chance. Anybody has a chance, cause like I said, they could just steal the cover, the pen. I mean, so I'm just gonna be honest. I'm gonna be biased in this one. I'm going with Drew McIntyre. I'm so I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I love Drew McIntyre. I love all of them equally. But anyways, guys, I'm going with Drew McIntyre. I don't know what that song was, but good timing. Good timing. So I'll, yeah, I'm going with Drew McIntyre to become the fourth, no, the third WWE champion. Yes, hopefully. Because Vince likes him a lot. Yeah. That's on a little bit. <laughs> Anyways, guys. Yeah, I'm going with Drew McIntyre. I'm sorry, sorry. I'm, so, I'm sorry. You just have to add some comedy. Anyways, guys. I'm going with Drew McIntyre. Hope it's anybody's game. I won't be mad if Braun Strowman or Bobby Lashley win. So, yeah. I'm going with Drew McIntyre. So, next match is... Dam Damien Priest versus The Miz in a lumberjack match. This is an easy one. The Miz is gonna get beat up by Damien Priest, and Damien Priest is gonna win. Cause if it was just like Damien Priest and The Miz in a in the actual like one on one match, then John Morrison will will probably get involved. So I'm gonna have to go with the Damien Priest. So next match is my favorite match. It's not gonna be like oh, it's my favorite match. Because it has girls. I'm playing. I'm playing. I'm playing. I'm playing. I'm playing. You know, more comedy. Anyways, guys, yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. Woman. It has a woman. Anyways, guys, Charlotte Flair versus Rhea Ripley versus Oscar. I never. I, I wasn't trying to say favorite match. I was going to say more exciting match of the pay per view. The other ones are like the best matches. These are. This is going to be like the most exciting one. They're probably the same thing. Favorite. Exciting. I'm really excited for this match, that's what I'm trying to say. I don't know why it took me so long to say that. Anyways, guys, Real Ripley versus Charlotte Flair versus Asuka. So, Asuka is, I believe, a three time world woman. I have no idea. For sure, she has won the SmackDown and NXT. She's probably a, she's probably, yeah, she's probably a Grand Slam champion. So, yeah, she is. Charlotte Flair, of course, she is. And Real Ripley is barely getting onto her way. So yes, guys, we have two Grand Slam champions and one on her way. But like honestly, I think Charlotte Flair is gonna win, cause like, like, you know, she likes to win. <laughs> she's like, she's won every match, or well, not every match, but like, like what's one more like WWE championship on her, like career? You know, like, I think she's a ten. Not like what's eleven now? Like we all know she's she's won a lot of championship. So like, what's the point if she wins right now? Like, that's why I don't want to go with her. Like, like I'm, she might win because, like, she's a 10-time champion. But I want to go with, uh, I have to go with Asuka because I really want her to win. But I can't go with Asuka because Rhea Ripley is going to win. And I can't go with Rhea Ripley because freaking Charlotte Flair is there. And she didn't mean to get in there. But I'm going to have to stick with my guts and go with Charlotte Flair. Why does Charlotte Flair have to be in the ball with in the match? Could have just been Asuka and first Rhea Ripley. I mean, it was already at WrestleMania. But... Rhea Ripley beat Oscar, and Charlotte beat Rhea Ripley, but Oscar beat Charlotte Flair, so Oscar has won the match, the last match they ever fought against each other, any of them, so Oscar's probably gonna win, but Charlotte Flair is probably gonna pin Oscar, so I'm going to Charlotte. Yes, so this one, my predictions, guys. Oh, I'm so sorry for being so crazy in this video, but you know, I can't wait for. I'm just so excited for tomorrow, guys. So yeah, I, I didn't make sense in this video, but you know, I'm I'm still gonna post it. But yeah, guys. So hopefully, you enjoy this predictions, guys. I'm gonna say all my predictions again. So this match, I chose Charlotte Flair. Next match, I chose the Mysterios. I chose Roman Reigns, the Tribal Chief, the head of the table. I chose Damian Priest. I chose Drew McIntyre. And I chose Bianca Belair. Yes, I think those were all the matches. And if there's more announced, then tomorrow in my live reactions, I'll like they're gonna show the official match card in the kickoff show. If there's some matches I missed, I'll just predict the winner in the live reactions video. So I'll see you tomorrow in the live reactions video, guys. Hopefully, you enjoy this crazy uh, predictions for WrestleMania backlash. And I'm sorry 
Hopefully you don't hate me after this video because I just said some not bad things but just crazy things. So hopefully you enjoy, smash that up and subscribe and Kevin does it all. <sighs> out. Peace out. Woo! Done.